So what does the Dream Fellowship mean to me? I think the answer is opportunity. My research is in the field of terahertz science and technology. Now the terahertz frequency range of the electromagnetic spectrum is between the microwave and infrared regions. And it hasn't been very exploited to date, really owing to the lack of cheap, compact sources, detectors and systems. Yet there's a huge range of applications for terahertz science and technology across the physical, biological and medical sciences. Now I'm very fortunate at the University of Leeds to work in a very strong terahertz research group with excellent facilities. We work with a number of international collaborators from the States, from Europe and the Far East and we're taking some of our technology and looking to exploit it with industry. So you might ask, why do I need a Dream Fellowship? What will I do with that Dream Fellowship? And the answer is that I think it will give me time to reflect and to think about what we're doing, to look at new research directions, to consider how we're doing cross-disciplinary work, and to see how we can do things better. What will I do during the fellowship? Well, firstly, I plan to visit a number of labs in the States, Europe and Far East and look at how they do their research and particularly focusing on cross-disciplinary research. I want to see how they do that most effectively and the procedures they use to do that. I also want to see how they take early research and look to translate that for, to industry and see how that can be done in the best possible way. Moving back to my own research group in Leeds, I'd like to look and think about how we can do our research more effectively, how we can be more creative with our ideas, and also how we can ensure that the ideas of all the staff in our team can get reflected be they a lecturer or a senior academic, be they a postdoctoral researcher, be they a PhD student, or they be they one of our undergraduate students who's doing a project with us. How can we assure that everyone's ideas are heard and that we can make the most of them? We've got some excellent facilities for doing terror science and technology. Can we make more use of them by working with people outside Leeds and through collaborations? And equally, others have got good facilities that we haven't got at Leeds. Can we work more with them to develop the whole field? So by the end of the fellowship, what will I have got? I hope I've got more effective research within our team at Leeds, new ways of doing cross-discipline research, and I'll be helped to know what we should be doing in the terahertz research field at the University of Leeds over the next decade and perhaps be able to influence the international community in their research as well. And possibly, I may even have found a new research direction to work on that is not terahertz science and technology. <laughs>